Hi everyone from the Love and Nail Person or Joanne. And this is going to be uh -huh. Sephora has all their weekly wows happening. Um, Ulta has their skincare event. Uh, uh, Macy's has uh, sales on uh, holiday items. So just a lot of stuff and I'm just, um, I was on a lull there and I kind of picked it up a little bit. I knew I would buy a little bit more with the skincare event, but it seems Sephora's got the ordinary now. So I got some of that too. So let's just start with skincare. I kind of broke it into two baskets so I could um, grab and know what category it's from. So I have skincare and fragrance in one basket. So this I picked up from Ulta. This is the Exuviance Performance Peel. So the past three years I've purchased this every time. I want to say it's like close to $80 for 12 uses. And it is just that. It's a skin peel. It's it's no joke. In fact, um, one year I didn't pull down the um, neutralizer far enough and I went to bed and I did have a burn on my neck. So basically you have two steps. You have the um, peel product and it's um, sort of like a cotton pad soaked in the product and you just rip it open and apply so it's very easy but you got to be careful. So you have the peel you just wipe on the face and um, I use it on the back of my hands as well. You use it for I think it's like um, five or ten minutes and then you use the neutralizer pad which is again another cotton pad soaked and you just wipe it off and if you have sensitive skin you could rinse as well and I love this product. It's very expensive. I would only buy it on sale so I just wanted to share this. If you see this come up, um, it was already on the first day of Ulta's sale, so it's already gone. Uh, another product, and this is from Ulta, and this was free. This is um, the Paracone MDH2 Elemental Energy Hydrating Cloud Cream. And I've never tried this before, but it was free with I think a $50 purchase so there you go and I, I don't think I've ever used anything from Paracone MD and I hope I don't love it too much because I think it's expensive but very glad to have some I was very surprised when I opened the box and saw this full-size product so a face cream excellent and I think in the same order with the Exuviance I got this It Cosmetics Bye Bye Line Serum and again, we're into the face care and I love serums. I use a serum every day. So we'll try this out. I think it has some um, blurring technology and drops of light. So it might illuminate as well. So I will try this out and let you know. And then um, another product that was on Ulta's special was the Murad. Rapid Age Spot and Pigment Pigment Lightning Serum. So this was half price and I love Murad products. They tend to be pricey as well. And getting older, um, you do get age spots. I do have some on my cheek here. And some of my freckles are kind of connecting. So I get this uh, spot here. So I thought I would try this out. I think I've had samples, but I didn't use it long enough to, I think, see full results so um happy to try a full size and um having a full ounce i think i would expect to see some kind of results and if i don't then we move on i had mentioned sephora and they now have the ordinary so this is the hyaluronic acid it says it's a hydration support formula with ultra pure vegan hyaluronic acid, 2%, with B5 as well. I already have a bottle of this and I've been using it, I want to say about a hmm, week and a half, two weeks maybe. And this is a good product. I use it kind of like a serum, so after I cleanse my face then I would go in with this guy. And hyaluronic acid helps um, your skin plump up. So if you have wrinkles, it'll help plump up where the wrinkles are pushed out so you don't have that deep wrinkling. 
and it's just a clear serum and from the ordinary products are all very uh, affordable so I think this bottle was like seven bucks I think so I did get two of them and they go at, out of stock real quick so I when it came back in stock I picked up two because I've been liking it so yeah and this is another product from the ordinary I haven't tried it yet but it is vitamin C, which is again a brightener and helps with any spots or whatnot. And um, just overall, vitamin C is great for your skin. This one is, um, I think, a few more dollars, but it has, there's two different versions of this. It has less vitamin C, um, but it's a grittier type of um, product, so you might feel it on your face when you apply it. The other one had higher vitamin C, but it was silicone based. So I don't want silicone on my face. So um, a lot of my foundations or whatnot don't play well with silicone. So I don't want that. So this was the silicone free uh, vitamin C. So a nice tube of this. And again, affordable. I, I think it was... Uh, eight dollars or under and vitamin c brightening for your skin excellent um now fragrance macy's had half off holiday kits and gosh i have tons of fragrance however i haven't had this one in a while and was so happy to see this i i already got rid of the boxes because it was quite bulky they had two different kits from philosophy in the fresh cream scent and fresh cream is um, a vanilla based I think cream so vanilla and it's not that it's a sweet vanilla but it's not that drugstore sweet vanilla it's very interesting um, nothing too obnoxious could wear this to the office no problem so the one kit had the six ounce uh, shower gel, the body polishing scrub, and they're all in the same scent, fresh cream. They had the body lotion, and they also had the four ounce body spray. So pretty set for the summer months on the weekend or during the week. And another kit had the, I think this is four, two ounce. This is the two ounce fresh cream fragrance. So nice size bottle. And it also came with the, I guess this is the roller ball. Yeah, it's a roller ball. Oh, it smells so good. So this was, I think, $15. No, this one was a little bit more. I think this was 16 with the half off. And this was probably 18 for the other four products, but I highly recommend pricing. checking out the Philosophy Fresh Cream. I love most of the fragrances in that line. Um, big fan. So now for more of the makeup type, and I have some hair in here, and nails too. So I didn't wear this yet, but I do have two nail polishes I picked up. Um, Butter London always comes out with the Pantone Color of the Year nail polish and it's going to be ultraviolet this year so there's ultraviolet i haven't tried it yet but i'll probably do a video i've done um the pantone color of the year and nail polishes and sh similar shades the last few years so i'll probably do that as well and this was on sale as well the butter london it's called brassy I just thought that was a, a really interesting shade. So, two nail polishes, some hair care. Again, Ulta's, they've been having sales and half price and whatnot. So, yes, I think I got, maybe this was 20% off with something with Sephora, I think. This is the BB Don't Blow It Fine Hair Styler. So, you know, I'm... I, out of all the things I don't I'm not a big hair person so I just kind of let it go and um, this is just a uh, lotion cream that just contains your hair so it's not wild 
it says it's the first of its kind cream enhances texture and body with a soft product free feel for your perfect air dried style which is me so that's me in a tube and i also picked up i like this as well this is the alterna caviar cc cream 10 in 1 so it's a leave-in perfecter so again just rub it on uh, when your hair is wet and you could just go and it has some benefits because it's sort of those 10 in 1 so it's moisturizing defrizzing body yada yada so right up my alley for makeup and um, this I got from Macy's although it's Mac um, again products that are on discount because this is after the holidays this is the fix plus trio in the sense which they just announced that these will now be permanent we have coconut we have lavender and rose so this was discounted as well i think this was like 12 or 15 dollars for the three of them so can always use fix plus i also picked up one of these at i think before the holidays right before the holidays i meant to wear it i never did this is the Stila Glitter and Glow Liquid Eyeshadow, and it's in Kitten Karma. And I know everyone raves about these products, and I, I didn't get to try it yet. I don't know where I'll get to wear some glitter soon, but I just thought I would try that out. So there's Kitten Karma, and it has a nice little doe foot, foot applicator. So, excited to try that out. Another product that, it's, this is fairly new. Um, this is the Bite Beauty, um, what do we call this? The Prismatic, this stick? is the Bite Beauty Prismatic Multi Stick. So it looks like the typical Bite Beauty lipstick. And when you open it, it's of course a lighter shade. And these multi sticks are meant to be used on your lips, cheeks, eyes, wherever. I do have a few minis that I've tried with the creamier shade, but I thought this would be a nice addition to the ones I have. And I'm not sure if I'm, I'm loving this. Um, this one is in blush pearl. And what I saw right away is glitter. So I don't know if I'll catch that, but... Um, they're nice and creamy, but I would probably use that as a, a on my eye or highlighter. I don't think I'd use that on my lip. But um, I don't know. I have to play around with it more. I don't know if I'm in love with this or what I would I reach for it or not. I also had a Jeffree Star order. I got the lip scrub. Um, I think just the two things. This is from his holiday line, and this was Christmas Cookie, and I haven't even worn this yet. So it's a great nude shade. have to smell it. It doesn't really smell like much to me. So that's Christmas Cookie. It's a great nude. I don't know why I'm not wearing this yet. Oh, because my lips have been very dry, that's why. I've been having some issues with really dry lips, and a liquid lipstick, you know, was going to dry out your lips. So I haven't been reaching for it liquid lipsticks but that's awesome <laughs> such an awesome shade he does such a great job with his lip liquid lipsticks you have to admit that speaking of lips um sephora in their weekly wows we had some urban decay lip pencils and i'm finding i love them so this one is in wired so there's wired so that's kind of like a coral and I'm really, really, really liking them. This one's Insanity. <laughs> it's funny. Funny name. And this is more of a warm nude, I think they described it as. So it's Insanity. I really like that one a lot. And then finally, HSN sent me a 20% off coupon. So I picked up my Lancome Monsieur Big Mascara. So there we go. You know I like this stuff. So, I don't want to take this too long before the camera shuts off, so that is it. 
If you have any questions, let me know. I'll leave the bubble here to subscribe, and I will talk to you soon.